Hi, Dan Paladin bringing you another episode of the Mortgage More So. Well, the day after the FOMC meeting, boy, did rates get rocked yesterday. It's got to be one of the worst days in quite a long time. Rates have uh, blew through two year highs, so they're sitting up there pretty good. 10 year note cracked even this morning, 2.6. I think it fell back below. So, what does that mean? Um, Obviously, depend. It's going to hurt first-time home buyers for the most part, especially anybody that was on the chalk line regarding debt ratios, because the movement in rate uh, by as much as a quarter percent can you know, push people back to the sidelines or have them not qualify for something they were in. So, um, I don't see or hear much about any major improvement from this point out. Uh, it just with. The economy and what they're thinking it's going to be stable and improving new administration supposedly as well um, unless we have some foreign economic event or one here uh, there's no chatter about uh, any big improvement uh, so we're kind of where we're at uh, in the low fours to mid fours uh, so if you have any clients that are thinking about it you might get them on the off the fence and get them going now uh, next anticipated move could be springtime. So that's my advice. Uh, hopefully nobody's ran into any issues with any current clients that hopefully they were locked before yesterday's, um, meaning Thursday, you'll see this on Friday. So meaning Wednesday's, I'm sorry, Wednesday's uh, big move. And um, have any questions on, want any more info regarding what's expected regarding the market or just any other help regarding marketing itself? <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, feel free to reach out to me. And uh, quick and short today. Uh, so that's it for this episode of The Mortgage Morsel. And if you're working, I'm working. Have a great weekend.